The kitchen's finally done, y'all. And we're gonna take a quick tour around and show you. So first off, this, you see the island here? This is where I do my videos, by the way, if you guys didn't know. So I got some granite countertops. How do you take a look at it? It's pimp like, I know. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> It looks fantastic to me. Um, painted the walls. We took it from green to agreeable gray. Look at that. And then the floors we did over. And these are um, vinyl planks. So, of course, they look like wood, but it's vinyl. And it fits together like laminate, like, like, a, pizza, uh, like a puzzle. So you know this is like waterproof. That's why I didn't go with laminate in here. I went with uh, vinyl. So yeah. See that little grayish little uh, streak right there to match the paint. You see, you see. Anywho, let me show you the rest here. So the black stone is going to be my stove top, which most of you already know that already. And down here where the oven part would be to the stove, which I completely um, sold my stove. I don't even have a stove any longer because I don't need an oven. I don't need an oven at all. I haven't, when I have my Samsung stove, I haven't used the oven in two and a half years. So I'm going to build some custom, well, I'm not, I'm going to have built some custom shelves there and I'm going to store some gadgets there. Some gadgets that are not particularly on my counter but that I use in my videos, that would be a great spot to keep them um, easy access off the floor and not cluttered anywhere. That's perfect, actually. This is my sink, y'all. I love my little sink here, man. It's nice and deep. Now, I've had this sink for about two years, but I don't really show it on my videos. But yeah, this is my sink. See like my Instant Pro up there, that's gonna come down when I have my um, my shelves built. Probably the Chef IQ as well. Oh, and I wanted to show you that my Blackstone uh, cover can't fully open because of my microwave and that's fine. Because I could just take it off. And I would say about 60% of the thing, 70% of what I'm making on the griddle, which is my new stovetop, I won't require the cover. And, and and you know what? I can put a dome on there if I want. I don't have to put the cover on. I can rest the cover up there. But when I get my shelves put in, I'm going to, the first shelf will be for the cover of the Blackstone. And like maybe like uh, my silicone scraper, I can put it right there. So I have it right there. But most of the stuff that I make, if I need to melt something, I could put something like that right on there. Easy peasy, no problem. I just put back the cover. So, this is what my kitchen looks like remodeled. Now guys, I promise, back to cooking now. <laughs> it's Cooking with Doug, and we out.